All right, well, we're, con we're finishing up the seed tonight one way or another. I have a feeling it actually might be a shorter than usual stream since we only have Stone Tower left. Now granted, we still need the Elegy of Emptiness and the Oath to Order, but I know where that Oath to Order is. It also sh Actually, no, we got the Fierce Deity Mask. I was gonna say it, it would help to get the Giant's Mask, but we actually don't need it. And there's not a whole lot of places left for us to go looking for stuff, so... I have a feeling most of what we need is gonna be found at Akana. Well, if you ever do get the chance, Majora is very fun. A bit a bit stressful the first time you play due to the time limit. But it it's a wonderful game. One of my favorites. Still no lens of truth, that's interesting. Come Apona. We ride to Akana. Of how Apona just merges out of the wall. Also, just as a reminder, folks who are watching on Twitch, uh, music requests are still 50% off. So you can save them arty bucks, and because this is the last stream of the year, this will be your last chance of redeeming those before 2022. Also, don't know when the next uh, custom music stream is going to be, because I've got some plans for 2022. No, that's the wrong mask. Gora. Goron, please. Oh, and we still got that Chateau Romani coursing through our veins. This is excellent. Okay, we only have free arrows, so we gotta make them count. There we go. Hey, X-Dude! Welcome to the stream! How are you doing tonight? We're just heading into the land of the dead in time for Christmas. No big deal. There we go. And we finally get that owl statue. What's the definitive way to play Majora's Mask? I mean... I would, I would say it would be the N64 version, but I also know that's very difficult to get. The GameCube port is okay. It can crash randomly, which sucks. But honestly, at this point, I would say as long as you're playing the N64 version, you're probably doing great. The 3DS port was alright, but not amazing. Alright, <laughs> Phobotomy Corporation Second Trumpet has, whatever the heck that is, has been added to the song queue. And here we go, here's the Oath to Order. Gonna need that to finish up the seed. No Gibdo Mask, which means we can't do much in the bottom of the well. Maybe the uh, Poe Sisters will have something for us. Can't go into the music box house either, because we don't have the Song of Storms. Well, if... Actually, we're missing quite a few, because we also need the Stone Tower boss key. Stone Tower Temple boss key. So actually, we might not be as close to the finish as I thought. Alright, let's deal with you. Glad to hear it, X-Dude. There you go. Oh, shoot. Um, we only have one arrow. I wonder if that's going to affect things. Well, we'll have to figure that out after I put in um, Lobotomy Corporation Second Trumpet.
that actually is a thing. Second trumpet, you said? Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay, good, you can use the hook shot. It's weird how you can't change your masks uh, in this room. Oh, dang, this slaps. Just like Santa Claus at the Council of Nicaea. I mean, what? <laughs> Was it you? No, it wasn't you. Oh, wow. She is way weaker than I thought. The hook shot defeats her really easily. This is anxiety and mutant. No, this is not. This sounds awesome. Catching streams on time can be hard, and that's why I try to minimize it as much as possible. Uh, by the way, I literally didn't even pay attention. Oh, wait, we got bomb shoes. I'm like, I don't even remember what he gave us, and he gave it to us like two seconds ago. Well, let's see if the ancient castle of Akana has anything for us. We gotta be careful with our, uh, our arrow supply here. Yeah, exactly. I'm so glad that you requested that song, by the way. I'm kind of obsessed with that song now. So good. Oh, there we go. There's our arrows. Okay, there are free checks in the Castle of Akana. If Elegy of Emptiness is in its vanilla location, that would be interesting. Sorry, Redeads, I don't have the Gibdo Mask. Oh, okay. Oh, then this is... Alright, well, let's, let's fight Egos Duakana. One of my absolute favorite characters. This fight is amazing, both in terms of, like, mechanics, setting, awesome. So good. No! Those were my prize curtains! Also, you're saying that was anxiety in, uh... In music form? No, 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 no. I'll, I'll, I'll show you anxiety in music form. Uh, where is it? Yeah, this is it. <laughs> Uh, apparently that got, that song got muted. Never mind. I was going to play the music from Banjo-Kazooie when the, uh, the ceiling starts falling on you in Gobi's Valley. But apparently the only song that was uploaded of that, uh, didn't actually have the song, the music. Oh. Dog on it. All right. Chipsell, not today, Satan, has been added to the song queue. All right, Egos, let's roll. Now I want to knock him towards the light, ideally. Oh, pff, I accidentally hit him with my mirror shield. Everybody's getting bomb shoes. I mean, I don't want to be ungrateful during the the Christmas time, but 
If I could get an, an empty elegy, that would be that would be to my liking. All right, let's see what's on the pillar. To this day, don't know if this is the intended way of doing the puzzle, but it's how I do it. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't know why it was muted, but it was. Alright. Well, regardless of if it's the intended solution, it is a viable one. A back route, if you will. And anybody from the uh, Lemmings forums knows exactly how I feel about back routes. It's the best. Okay, so... Chipzel not... <laughs> it's the first thing that came up! <laughs> oh, Dicey Dungeons. Wait. This one also isn't giving me any... That also wasn't giving me any music. Hang on. Oh, this is weird. I'm running YouTube through an external program for my randomizer. Okay, now it's working. Dicey Dungeons has a great soundtrack. Based on the little that I've heard. All right, enjoy yourself, noob. Ooh, yeah, that saxophone. It's okay, we kill the spiders in this game, DX. All right, what's over there? It's a stick, not worth grabbing. Well, this is the only part of the maze that we can do! Alright. <laughs> elegy or Soul in the Storms would be nice. It's the Elegy of Emptiness! Alright! <laughs> well, that is fitting. Looks like we're heading off to Stone Tower Temple. So at this point, I believe once we grab the boss key for Stone Tower Temple, we are in go mode. But we can't celebrate just yet, because the boss key could be hidden behind the 15 stray fairies in Stone Tower Temple. That would kind of suck. Oh yeah, the saxophone's going hard on this one. I love it. This is another one of those rooms where if you have random sound effects turned on, it's not fun. Because the sound of boulders falling gets randomized. I will be seeing uh, Caesar over the weekend, yes.
Oh, now I now I can pull up the anxiety music that I wanted to. Anxiety, thy name is Lord Sandy Butt. Also another good choice for anxiety music is the Sonic Drowning music. That's a different kind of anxiety, though. I will try to take a photo of his, his Royal Caesarness when I am home. Alright, here we go. Yeah, YouTube comments say stuff like that. It's great. Okay, you're moving that way. Uh, I pushed the play button on my playlist, but uh, apparently didn't register. There we go. How many boulders will I get hit by in here? The boulders are my mortal enemy in the uh, the free DN64 Zelda games. Especially in the Fire Temple. Wee! Out of all the changes they made to the Majora's Mask randomizer, I think Instant Elegy of Emptiness is my favorite. Nope, we got Fierce Deity's Mask. Twin Mold should not be that big of a problem. Also, I've had to fight Twin Mold without Giant's Mask or Fierce Deity's Mask before. It is annoying, but it is difficult. It's kind of like uh, Tag Anywhere from DK64. Where I'm like, yeah, that would probably be nice, but I don't know, the Tag Barrels aren't too bad, and then it's like you play it, you're like, oh man, no, this is amazing. Alright, let's go into the dungeon right side up first. Still need to get all of the uh, checks in here. The Zora statue looks uh, interesting. All right, maybe we should get some, you know, like arrows before Grat going in there. Yeah, there we go. There, there we go. Thirty-four arrows. That's more my speed. That's true! Playing the DK64 randomizer, <laughs> I find I run out of HP a lot more quickly. Ooh! You know, this is kind of fitting music for Stone Tower Temple. Loving it! I would like this dungeon a lot more if every single treasure chest didn't appear on the upside down area from where you actually were. It's really annoying when, uh, how it does that.
no blast mask. All right. You're craving a steak and cheese sandwich. What's what's a lady to do? I guess decide if you want to actually eat the steak and cheese sandwich or if you want to eat healthier. Or make or make a healthy steak and cheese sandwich. I like how the Deku Elegy of Emptiness statue is, like, completely useless. Because it doesn't even weigh stuff down. <laughs> I love how they're like, we're gonna fill this dungeon with, because it's the last dungeon, we obviously need the most dangerous enemies, and they put the dragonflies in. I'm not even saying this is a bad decision! I think that's actually smart of them. <laughs> Is there anything more boss than punching living statues while in lava? Yeah, that would that would help. I hate the co-ops. Cops with a K. Yay. Don't want to forget about the chest up here. All right, time to bypass the first small key. I think if we want to check everything, I think we do need another small key. Which is rough. Bum bum! What's in the box? Stray fairy. Makes sense. Oh look, it makes an upside down chest. What a surprise. Okay, the Soul Sanctum music is even more epic than I remember. Yep, those are parts of the elite Kremlins. The ones that are actually good at their job. Oh no, it's my least favorite room in the dungeon. All right, I did the first part first. Oh no, not ice trap. Okay. A fairy in a bottle. Is that an actual... Nope, that was just a generic old fairy from the shop. Who needs to melt that <laughs> sunblock? If the boss key's not in here, I'm trying to figure out where it would be. I hate this room so much. It's like, you gotta do a frame-perfect, pixel-perfect dive jump. Twice. Twice. 
No, I have not. Oh boy, a silver rupee. Here's hoping there's something behind this door. There's quite a few checks back here, so it is worth doing. No stake, no! I'm sorry, DX. Oh, another one of my favorite parts of this randomizer is not having to do this puzzle the vanilla way. This puzzle without light arrows is terrible. Small key for the Snowhead Temple. Thanks, I didn't need it. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of mechanics. I haven't seen that many mechanics since my last roller coaster tycoon stream. This room also kind of sucks. Actually, now that I think about it, this dungeon is not very good. It had a really cool idea, but it just doesn't really do it for me. Oh wait, I uh, I might know actually. I might know where uh, a remaining check is. There could be something for sale at the curiosity shop on the final day. If we save the lady from being mugged, which we did not. Spitting straight facts, Nintendo Addict. That is exactly how it feels. Wow, first try. <laughs> and I mess up going home. And hey, we get almost the vanilla music. Also can't believe I am only missing free heart containers. There are so many pieces of heart in Majora's Mask. Although I'm pretty sure they added more heart containers than there are in the vanilla. Bad, Remy. What you got for me? Another stray fairy. <laughs> hey, Mobius, welcome. No, 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 you are just in time for the Garrow Master. Ooh, actually, I haven't been using this mask nearly enough. He laughs and the music cuts out. Okay, it's actually kind of hard to avoid these guys' attacks. See a Garrow Master. Oh, if you think that's a creepy boss, <laughs> wait till you see the second one. <laughs> Although the second one is my all time favorite Zelda mini boss. Yay, Stray Fairy. Yeah, just a little bit. Okay, I didn't really want to be Deku Link. I wanted to get out the bombs. This is Objection 2002 from Phoenix Wright, Justice for All. I 
aka the soul in the place when you realize Mr. Wellington loves large bananas! It's great! Oh boy. <laughs> it's Halloween again. We already have ten of the stray fairies. Wow. Everything must be upside down. Stupid dragonfly, get out of- No! I hate- I hate the dragonflies. Oh wait, the, what am I doing? Is there a reason that you're just listing every enemy in Zelda and non-Zelda games? Is this like a word game that I'm not familiar with? Gotta love the hitbox on the jewel! I guess there also could be something over here. This is why I stocked up on magic beans and spring water. What could be behind box number one? It's an ice trap. Okay, how about box number two? A piece of heart to heal the damage that I took from the ice trap. Okay, so it's broken even. How about this one? Oh boy, that opens up. That opens up beneath the well. Okay, so we are playing Nork Cove. From Spyro. I re I remember blogs. Oh yeah. Well, yikes. That didn't turn out too well. Thankfully, falling into the heavens doesn't actually kill us. Oh boy, another bottle of milk! It's not like I already have five of them. No, I didn't need that. Yeah, I'm hoping the Stone Tower Temple boss key is not beneath the well, because I don't like going beneath the well. Because it's like, oh, do you want to explore everywhere in the well? Oh, then uh, you need to get me ten magic beans. It's like, why, though? Because that's what I feel like eating today. Chomp, chomp, chomp. It's because there's so much milk hidden in the overworld. Because all of the cows that normally give you milk have their milk shuffled in the pool. There's also a shop that sells milk. The milk bar sells milk. The Gorman brothers sell milk. There's so much milk. I don't even like milk. I first personally find it disgusting. I think there's only eight cows in Majora's Mask, but because there's a bunch of shops that sell it too, that uh, brings the average up a little bit. No! Poor little Deku Link. Despite all that, though, you only took a quarter of a heart's worth of damage. Alright, 
right, let's see what's in here. Oh boy, it's a small key for the Stone Tower Temple! Cool! We can explore everywhere now. The whole temple can be explored. How wonderful. And speaking of milk... <laughs> Health? Calcium? It's good for you. Alright, hip loop, get out of here. I don't want to deal with you. Alright, our 11th stray fairy. This is Harvest Moon music. Yeah. Spring Breeze from It's a Wonderful Life. Why did you just turn 180 degrees around when I did not tell you to do such a thing? I am Supreme Overlord Dictator of your life, Deku Link. And non-Deku Link. Like, the whole, you turn the temple upside down thing, it's cool in concept, but most of the puzzles involving it aren't good, because it's just like, oh boy, you hit this switch, chest appears upside down. This is a good puzzle. Uh, it completely depends on the sandworm. Mulgara from Wind Waker is kind of fun. The Mulducane from Breath of the Wild? Not so much. Oh, I remember Armorbus from Prime... Th Most of the Prime 2 bosses were not fun. Looking at you, Boost Ball Guardian. Oh, I also like, I also like fast block pushing. That's another great addition to this dungeon. Or to this randomizer. But, like, puzzles like this are kind of monotonous. Spider-Ball Guardian was one of those boss fights where I'm like, I died to it a bunch, and I'm like, this boss fight should not be difficult. But it was. And then there's the chicken larva, but that boss fight sucked. Because it took forever. It took me forever to realize you needed to use Seeker Missile against that fight. Oh, no, and it keeps hiding out of reach, so I have to shoot him with light arrows. Oh, nice! I would like to play Metroid Prime on my channel, eventually. Bye bye. Prime 2. <sighs> it had some good ideas, but man, that game was kind of a slog to get through. Yep, this is indeed Rigor Mormist. Plants vs. Zombies had an amazing soundtrack. Also, in case those of you uh, were curious, the composer of Plants vs. Zombies frequently does music streams. And it's pretty awesome. She's a cool lady. You are a fool! Well, I didn't know a disembodied great fairy head was inside that chest waiting to curse whoever opened it. <laughs> what is this? Thousand Year Door?
It's funny because this whole temple is basically made to blaspheme the gods. So I guess it's kind of fitting. Twelfth stray fairy. I would actually prefer the stray fairy reward to be the boss key over uh, the boss key being in the, beneath the well. Yes, we're approaching best mini boss. This is going to be very unfitting music for the mini boss, but all right. <laughs> ah, yes, the song of animal abuse. All right, here we go. Hello, Gomez. This guy should have been the full-on boss of the dungeon. Doggone it, he has the coolest design out of any boss. But yeah, he is it's Dracula meets the Grim Reaper. It's amazing. He's also a bit harder if you don't have the Great Fairy Sword. Psalm of Storms! Alright, we can get into the music box house now. And like literally only that, because Psalm of Storms stinks in Majora's Mask. Although I guess I can decurse myself. I always forget Deku Link even has his little spitballs, because you never use it in the random visor. <laughs> this is not a Paper Mario song. This is a remaster of a Mother Free song. Boss key in sight. <laughs> Although if the boss key was here, it would be pretty hype. Boski here would be pretty hype. Although that would also mean our stream would end early. <laughs> I'll take a bundle of arrows too. You know what? I was running low. Kind of. Oh yay! A final upside down chest! Here we go. Upside down. 
can't turn me inside out. Oh, that's right, we gotta do this block puzzle again. It would be dumb if the final stray fairy was hidden behind uh, Twin Mold. Although there's a decent chance that that is what's going to happen. Yep. Hyrule Castle or Kestrel Remake. Oh, that's right, the chest is at the bottom. Twenty bucks? The ad said three thousand. Okay, did you really miss a giant dragonfly with your light arrows? How did we miss the upside down chest? can't believe it, but I'm breaking up the map. It could be. It's not likely, but it could be. More likely it's a stray fairy. Yay, we get to do the Deku flower again. I don't think I've ever heard the Dark Hyrule Castle music from Minish Cap. I never beat Minish Cap. I made it to the Sky Dungeon, got lost, never figured out how to beat the boss, and then gave up. Let's go in here. A hundred bucks. Alright, well, I'm not returning to that chest unless it's, like, pretty late. <laughs> oh, hey, okay, I will add Dark Hyrule Castle from Inish Cap to the song queue. I look forward to hearing it. And it, I also, it has occurred to me there's another place that I can look. Something that I don't think I've checked yet. So the last stray... The last stray fairy, that means... Actually, wait! Was I missing one or two stray fairies from Stone Tower? If I was missing two, then that means... That chest has one, and then the boss has the other. Which, actually, I think that's the case. Let's remind everybody of the love they once had. I hope the mayor's still having his meeting right now. Just in time. I think they break at one, so... It's the couple's mask! Token of his gratitude. It's ten arrows. You weren't that grateful.
It also could be behind the Smithy guy, because we did fail to get the gold dust. Alright, well, if we're gonna... I can't remember where the blue potions were. You need a blue potion to proceed for part of the... Beneath the Well. Don't remember where it is. Alright, but I'm clearing out some of this stupid milk. Alright, Link. It's time to get some strong bones. Alright, Dark Hyrule Castle. Okay, I don't want a remaster. I want the original Dark Hero Castle for Minish Cap. Okay, can we get something between 1 minute and 15 minutes, please? There we go. That's right. I also do not remember where the uh, where the swamp title deed was. I always forget where the title deeds are. There's so many of them. Is that where it was? The Ocean Sculpture House? Hmm. Not all of it, no. Hello, Mommy Dad. That's okay, the pattern was not hard to figure out. <laughs> he dropped 50 bucks for me! But that's okay, it's worth it to give the little girl her dad back. Although his big lips are kind of creepy. And that dude is why you don't research mummies. You got the 50 bucks bat mask. It's a mask that will... <laughs> it's a mask that when you wear it will remind, remind everybody that you have 50 bucks. Hey Proxima, welcome! We are literally looking for the boss key for Stone Tower Temple and then we can beat the seed. Alright. Well, you know, you know, Simpson, you have a very good memory. So I will try Ocean Sculpture House. At the very least, it's not that far out of our way, so... Okay, so it was like a slower, sadder, darker version of Hyrule Castle. Alright, that was an interesting listen. Oh boy, it's time for darkness within darkness within darkness within darkness within darkness! <laughs> also known as Lemonin's Oscura. In this timeline, Pamela's father was studying money, <laughs> not mummies. Money. <laughs> I'm 
just obsessed with the Pharaoh's mummy. You mean the Pharaoh's mummy? No, Pharaoh's money! We've got to have money! <laughs> it's true. Alright, let's try not to hit these guys who are just having a party here. So I remember red was first, then I think green. I did remember it! <laughs> Wow! You, okay, yeah, you have a good memory, <laughs> if nothing else. how Kingdom Hearts can take one melody, make so many songs off of it, and it's all amazing. <laughs> oh, you... <laughs> you... You rapscallion? Should I forget? Have we even done this trade to begin with? Yeah, we did. <laughs> okay, cool. We got three empty bottles. We can fill one with a blue potion. A cordon bleu potion. Yeah, I got lucky there. The Wolfos could have easily knocked me off a cliff. And then just, that would have been the end of it. Oh, also... I don't remember if I checked what was on the floating island on the path to Snowhead. But if there's something there, we're going to have to reset the time cycle for it, because all the ice blocks that lead there have melted. Actually, no. We're going backwards through the well. Uh, yes, I believe I did check the grotto in the path to Snowhead. Well, that's because all the times I checked there, I didn't have the hook shot. So I'm like, well, there's not any point in checking. Hello, I am- yes, I am fellow mummy. You mean mummy? No, money! I found the money, Mrs. Tittlemouse! <laughs> oh, and speaking of amazing Kingdom Hearts music. Oh, well that was just uncalled for. I will burn you alive. What's that, burning him alive is also uncalled for? Wow, that's interesting, but I sure don't care. <laughs> what do you want? A ghost. A big one. Oh, shoot. I'm... Something small and creepy. Oh, no, this is the room I was looking for. <laughs> exactly. It's less creepy here than it was in Ocarina. Fifty dollars! See, the mummies love money. Now it's time to grind up on Deku Nuts. Because there's a guy in a nearby room who wants like ten of them. Oh. 
There's also a guy who's like, give me a fish. Give me H2O. Okay, what do you want? So, yeah, so you're the guy who wants the blinding flash. <laughs> hey, Shaggy. This is, this is rated E, somehow. So I don't think they can ask for beer. Give me D's nuts. Give me planters peanuts. Hot spring water, bro, come on! Oh, I didn't grind up on magic beans like I was supposed to. Whoops. That room just leads to a big po and nothing else, so... Actually, you know what? I can take the shortcut back. Pigpen, you're the only kid I know who could call bombs refreshing. <laughs> Give me Half-Life free! <laughs> you're gonna be waiting a long time, bro. It's a good thing that Link is here to help out with their requests and not loophole Santa. White Palace from Hollow Knight has been added to the song queue. Uh, oh, you're gonna, you're gonna make me catch it with my own bottle? <laughs> leave it! Leave it! Leave me the double quarter pounder with triple cheese! <laughs> Alright. Wow. You sure timed that? <laughs> uh, sound or, or song request well. I have a feeling we're not going to get the, uh, the Picto box in this run. It's just a gut feeling that I have. I... No! I don't have a fish! I'm sorry, bro. But I don't have one. Time to glug some milk! How is Link able to drink this milk through that mummy mask? I, I'd be down. Kasha's are cool enemies. Also, have there has there been a Zelda enemy before that has had, like, a giant club that they swing at you? A spiked club. Oh yeah, I think half the enemies from Breath of the Wild fall in that category. And this is why we got Blue Potion. Oh hey, it's the fish that the guy wanted. Unfortunately, we don't have ten magic beans to go the other way. Because of course the guy would demand ten magic beans. That's very easy to find at your local Whole Foods. Bruh, do you have any idea how expensive Whole Foods is? That's why I want it. You want a fish as well? Well, lucky you, I actually have one. Oh, there's also a cow down here somewhere. Oh, hey, fish! Okay, apparently Dexy Hand has a longer reach than my Gilded Sword. Alright, well... I was gonna make a joke about being the light. 
but something tells me that that wouldn't fly. The relaxing music belies the true horrors of this song. Okay, one. I know at least one of the guys down here wants something rich in calcium, so we're gonna dump the bugs to get the hot spring water. Because bugs are easier to get. <laughs> there you go, bugs! Okay, now we're gonna do what's called a pro gamer move. We have the hot spring water, we're gonna warp to Akana Canyon and then rush back into the ancient castle of Akana, drop down, and give the guy it the hot spring water backwards before it melts. This song is really making the, their last regrets a lot more uh, <laughs> a lot more serious than in the game. If I if I hadn't been able to get to the hot spring water in the well, I would have I would have gone to Snowhead to, to get hot spring water and warped back here. You lost track of my plan. Oh well, all you gotta know is that Artie's got a plan. That's that's all. You, that's all that's really that's, that's all that really matters, guys. <laughs> Don't worry, I got this. Has Artie ever steered you wrong? Even once. Honest Artie could never tell a lie. There you go. There's your hot water. I need a hot water bottle. I've heard they're all the rage. There. That was my plan. There's the cow! That's a weird camera angle. Yeah, that wasn't worth it. And at that point, that is everything on this side of the dungeon. Let's grab ourselves some more bugs, if at all possible. Oh boy, I have a fish for you right here, bro! Tell the other monies I said hi. You're not the bug boys I was looking for. What do you want? Don't tell me bugs. Oh, that's right. You wanted the ghost. <laughs> the cow gives an ice trap. Man, them some cold udders. An utter disaster. Look, man, I, I wanted to be nice, but you forced my hand. Master's biggest weakness, a first-person camera. <laughs> Thanks for joining in, DX. Have a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I hope their Christmas trees get termites. <laughs> There's, I think, one more chest in here. If it's not here, we're gonna have some problems. Leave me H2O. This mummy knows the chemical formula for water. Give me dihydrogen monoxide. I was sure a uh, spider guy was going to drop out my face. Wow, 
Wow, I can't believe it. They're going easy on me. So you lead to the fairy fountain. What do you want? Something small and creepy. There you go. Where's the one who wants the milk? I don't want milk. I saw that you only had milk. Yes, this is the room. Well, the well had nothing. Great! Okay. Dihydrogen monoxide is not a joke. It's true. You, what you said is factually true. Well, that's right. We can't even get what's out there without the lens of truth anyways, so... He probably did, but that Gibdo doesn't... I think the Gibdo that wants milk just leads to a fairy fountain, and there's nothing there. Alright, well then. I think we might have to reset the time cycle then. Is there a way to check how many stray fairies I have in the Stone Tower Temple? I guess I'd have to go to the dungeon to find out. I want to check to see if I have 13 or 14. Fourteen thousand, or fourteen hundred. All right, because I am terrified of Stone Tower Temple having the uh, big key in there. Is the fisherman still on his break? Um, I have no idea. It feels like half the time the fisherman's just like, I'm not working. No rhyme or reason. I'm just, I don't feel like it. And that's not the switch. But yeah, that's good. After I check Stone Tower Temple, I will check. I will do the Fisherman's game. That's a good call. Oh wait, I pushed literally every switch except the correct one. All right. Okay, this is ridiculous. I. Whatever. Excuse me, this is my me time. There we go. Wee! Wee! A wee! So if there are, if I only have 13 of the stray fairies, then I know the last two checks in here are both the stray fairies, and they cannot lead to something I need. Yep, okay. So it's not in the Stone Tower Temple. Okay then, let's head on over to Great Bay Coast. It also would be interesting if we got the uh, Great Bay Small Key so we could get the last Great Bay Stray Fairy. Because that could lead that could lead to the boss key. Alright, bro, are you on break? Evenings and first feet in the morning are your break times. Sure they are. Oh. 
This is why I hate the freaking fisherman. There's no rhyme or reason to his break times. He's just like, oh, I'm on break. So evenings and mornings are my break time. It's like, all right, it's noon. It's not morning. No, it's evening now. God, look at this guy's face, too. He looks like a frog. Bah, I'm on break. No. I know you're literally the only customer I've ever had, and this is my only chance to get rid of the No. No, I'm on break. Have you seen have you seen how many bags I have under my eyes, bro? There's like five of them under each eye. I'm so tired. Oh, I need to have a break. I need a break so bad. Oh, oh what's that? Oh, the moon is getting close to the earthquakes. That's gonna make the game even harder. I'm so tired. Just wanna go to bed. Sleep. Please just leave. I don't want you to give me money. How about now? There we go. <laughs> All right. This game either goes great or terribly, and there's no in between. It kind of depends on how the, well the camera wants to cooperate. Oh wow! It's the fisherman's game is has the fishers fisherman song playing. Bass Masters 2000. Oh no! Oh, that was that was a near fin. So, excluding this one, I can think of three other checks. Or four, four other checks. But one of them would require Lens of Truth on the platforms without the Lens of Truth. Lens of Truth is also locking us out of Shiro the Soldier and healing Darmani. Oh my gosh, did we heal Mikau? We did not heal Mikau. That's what we're gonna do. Here's your prize. This poor guy has been drowning in the sea for the last several time cycles. Let's finally heal him. Well, I, I don't believe in cheating. Yes, I do. Someone get me to shore, please! Dude, bro, like, heal my soul already, man! <laughs> yeah, I could've gotten this a while back. But if he, do if he does have the Stone Tower bot, Temple Boss Key, that means I can complete it this time cycle. If, if he doesn't have it, though, I don't- I think I have to reset the time cycle. For one of the free other checks. <laughs> He's got those shoes that are like the moving platforms at the airport. Set to max speed. We're not even going to listen to his last words. We're just going to play the Song of Healing. Yuck, I don't, I don't want that. <laughs> Quicksand's a terrible gimmick. Okay. What's it going to be? What's going to be? <laughs> Is it going to be the freaking boss key? Twenty bucks. <laughs> I need that money. Guess I get refunded for the fisherman's game. Rip off. It's like thanks for healing my soul. You can have all the money in my wallet. Why? Thank you. How gracious of you. <laughs> all right. Well. Yep. Time to reset the time cycle. Ba da 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 da. Now yours. Well, at least you guys are getting your money's worth out of the final stream.
The quickest way to the- I know the quickest way to the desert! No, we're not gonna have to check everything, because we know for a fact, from the hints, some areas have junk. Click clock wood? Um... Okay, hang on. When you say click clock wood, you're gonna have to be more specific. Because click clock wood has several songs in it. Spring, summer, fall, the lobby area... Because click... Again, there's... Spring. Okay. Thank you for clarifying. Here we go. There we go. So we get the gold dust. One other place that I have not forgotten about is the Deku Playground. Deku Playground's not much fun, but you know what? Whatever. We gotta check it. Wait, nope, we, we need money. And, uh, here we go. Yeah, Click Hawk, Click Hawk Wood has great music. Banjo Kazooie has great music in general. Wee! Alright, day one of the Deku Playground is pretty simple. Yeah, it's a good name. We're going to win at the Deku Playground now! Oh, shoot, hang on. Guys, I just remembered another check. But you know what? It's perfect. Because we need to save the old lady, which means we're gonna need to wait some time, and while we wait, we can get the other check. Banjo-Kazooie, yeah, I would say it's one of the best 3D platformers, although I still prefer Banjo-Tooie to it. But Kazooie is close second. Or actually, well, okay. Obviously, DK64, one of my favorites. The Rareware uh, 3D platformer trio is amazing. That is a very strange name for a Deku Scrub. You want to make something out of it? Anyone want to guess where the other check that I'm thinking of is? That no one's brought up yet that I totally forgot to do? Oh, and the Postman's game! That's another one. Okay. So there's actually five checks. Alright. We're getting busy! Okay, um... Okay, that's bad. I thought that you guys sold the thing I was looking for. Okay, well that's a bit problematic. One of the stores sell- hang on, no. One of the stores sells it. Maybe I will stream that next year, Nintendo Addict. Sounds interesting. Maybe, I think- no, I think it's the Zora Cape that sells it. Thank goodness you can keep your small keys through time loops. That's really nice. Bingo! I am looking for that red potion.
I did not know that the Scarecrow could show up here. That's good, because that's one of the reasons I hated Rusty Bucket Bay. It was like a harbor, but there were bottomless pits in it. Like, excuse me? Alright. Well, we can do this, uh, the Postman's game now. Let's see if we can do this first try. There we go. Okay, that opens some other stuff now. That opened- oh, that actually opens up a lot more. Okay, our next step, we are going to be giving that red potion we bought to Shiro. We also can get whatever is on the ice platforms in Snowhead. Shiro's just a short walk away, so let's start with him. Also, let's try to pick up some uh, light er er arrows along the way. Bingo! Because we need some more cash. Yep, Magmore Caverns for Metroid Prime. Great song. Oh, we could also do it with some Chateau Romani. Hey, bro. Here you go. $20, bro. That doesn't even pay for the, uh... Freaking Scarecrow is everywhere! What does that pot even have that would be worth it? Answer? Nothing. This is definitely the, prime, the version from Prime. Dude, I would like another red potion, please. Alright. We have to wait for the old lady anyways, so... Right, this this is just kind of like a generic Metroid song that got remixed in a lot of different games. Two Metroid games I would definitely stream in the future are uh, Prime and Zero Mission.
That's the giant's mask. I'll take it. You know? Could be useful against Twin Mole. I'll take it. Or it could be an ice trap. No, nope, it's the real deal. The real question is, what are the items that are on the moon? Would the zero mission randomizer require sequence breaking stuff like, uh, wall jumps? Probably. Alright, Kraid's Lair from Metroid Zero Mission has been added to the song queue. That's a good song. We should not need Chateau Romani. Twin Mold EX. I think that's, I think that's Mulgara from Wind Waker. Or the Moldu King from Breath of the Wild. Okay. Talk to him already. Poor guy. What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Peace of heart. It's potato! How's it going, potato? I don't know, but I uh, tried playing the Soul of Healing before talking to him, and it didn't work. But maybe I was just in the wrong position. Grandma is going to be there at midnight. on if people request it or not. <gasps> now we get to fight a doll was if you're Steady Link now. It's a fun way to pass the time. <sighs> I'm keeping an eye on the timer. Don't you get your pantaloons in a twist. Fast jungle warrior, Odalwa. Let's see how long it takes. Yep, that's about what I expected. <laughs> I would love Odalwa EX. He's one of my favorite bosses. Ooh, I will take that. Just in case I do want that Chateau Romani. You got 20 bucks! The light fakes. <laughs> hey, Deku Princess! Later, Deku Princess! 
Yuck. I... I don't even want to think about Georg EX. Georg is EX enough as is. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> That's a little ominous. Hey, Ghost Nick! Welcome! Welcome to the stream. So, Nintendo Attic, what you're describing is Georg. Twin Mold EX is just, it's free worms. It's Twin Mold! <laughs> Here you go, Kyame. I forgot to do Kyame archery. I did every other archery, but not Kyame archery. And I could have done this ages ago. Grandma's bodyguard is here sooner than expected. And Grandma's bodyguard is bigger than expected. Out of my way, punk. Double helix sword. What? This kid is smaller than one of my boots. Oh, wait. I don't have infinite magic. I need to stop spamming sword beams. <laughs> That could be bad. Seikon, you probably don't even want to try it tonight. Oh my! No! Don't worry, Granny. I am Fierce Deity, Protector of Termina. I will make sure that your bag does not get stolen. Hup, dup, dup. It's a wonderful day for a walk in the park of North Clock Town. Yoink! Yeah, you dropped that, bro. Oh! Alright, let's go to day two. Interesting. If this ever becomes a reality, you let me know. Okay, we got 60 bucks. Plenty of money for the second Deacon Playground, which is the hardest. Perfect music for the Deacon Playground. It's a fun little game for you to play around with your Deku Scrub. What's this song called? Trauma. Alright, I usually mess up at Deku Playground Day 2. Alright, so far so good. The first flower is the hardest. Oh yeah, the platforms that just move up and down are easy. The ones that are rotating, a little bit harder. Even on the third day where you got the, a mix of the two, still easier than when it's purely rotating.
Alright, though, that was really good. Nice. I gotta check out some of these. I always just associate ROM hacks with, like, Kaizo difficulty, and which doesn't appeal to me. Alright, Mountain Village, let's get the carpenters to get do my dirty work. Ooh! This is another song that's anxiety in uh, song form. I know, not all. But enough are that I associate it with that. Here you go, here's the gold dust. Come by tomorrow morning. Can do, will do, done. You requested that in the nick of time because this song was just ending. I have not done Kiyomai Archery yet. I'm saving that for the final day. Music, music. Not 30 minutes. Not 30 minutes. Uh, is this... Okay, here we go. Ooh. Strong start to the song. We literally just waited outside in the cold all this time for them to be done. All right, is this going to be the boss key? It's freaking red potion. I'd rather have the golden dust, you butt. All right, let's do Kyame Archery. So it, we still have Kyame Archery. We still have Deku Playground, and we still have Curiosity Shop. All of those are viable options. Hey, Elmage Hero! Welcome! Merry almost Christmas to you as well. Glad you could join in for a bit for the final stream. We are, we are scouring the map to get the Stone Tower Temple boss key. I think it has to be in one of three locations at this point. How about a little kid? Wanna fly on the broom? All right. Now it's time to shoot Kyame. I mean, shoot the target Kyame is carrying. Whoops, never mind. Also known as the real Swamp Archery. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Kyame's like, stop shooting me. Did I... With one arrow, did I shoot both the target and Kaume? We also could end up like, oh! Kaume Archery gives you the Don Garrow's mask, and that gives you the boss key. Oh man, I gotta be careful, actually. If I shoot her many more times, she's gonna be like, how dare you, I'm not doing this anymore. You know what makes this the hardest? The lag. The lag is actually not helping matters. Alright, I gotta be careful. She's 
it's a fun little game. I'll have this tiny target that I'll fly around with and challenge him to shoot it. Well, how dare he shoot me by mistake? Wow, he's on a boat ride. <laughs> Small key for Stone Tower Temple. I didn't need that, but cool. So close. So close, Kami. Kami's a pretty good... Sp She's a lot more patient with getting shot with a bow than I would be. Alright, Deku Playground. It's gotta be you or the Curiosity Shop. What do I find this music perfect for? I mean, it sounds like a really groovy winter song. All right, it's time for Lord Artie. I think Stone Tower Temple, or Snowhead Temple, not Stone Tower Temple, would be good for this. I love the, I love how the Deku Scrubs, their leaves make like a mustache. It's so cool. Just one of the reasons why I love the Deku Scrubs. Even if they are kind of scam artists. That was... That was almost bad. Also, guys, the highlights video for 2020... I don't want to blame that on lag. But it definitely felt like the lag played a role in me not making it there. Kome? I don't know. Do these, do these words actually have canon pronunciations. Like, everyone calls Deku Scrubs Deku Scrubs. That ain't canon, though. By the way, I don't say Kaume, I say Kyaume. I think the worst are the business scrubs in or the Oracle games. Where they're like, how about a shield for 100 rupees? It's like, um, I can buy that for 30 rupees at the Horon Village shop, ya Horon. Horon Village? More like Moron Village. That was, that was almost bad. Phew! Alright, Deku Playground. A shield. Is it literally going to be in the last spot we check? Probably. Yeah, we got to prepare in case it's not in the curiosity shop. If it's not in the curiosity shop, we're, uh... We're in for a time. Alright, now we just gotta wait for Curiosity Shop, man, the open shop. He's like, I'll give you the All Night Mask, which you need to listen to Grandma's stories. She gives you the Don Garrow Mask, so you need to get the Frog Concert. They give you the Picto Box, so you need to show Tingle a photo, uh, Tingle's dad a photo of Tingle, so then you could get the Boss Key. <laughs> well... Not much we can do here while we wait. I guess I'll have to brainstorm ideas for where else it could be. You know what? It's stupid to just sit here and wait and do nothing. We may as well grab the uh, Chateau Romane. Never forget the spring water, folks. I bet the blast mask and the captain's hat are on the moon.
Or, hmm. We also could end up getting, like, a, the Great Bay Small Key. Because with the small key, we can get the last stray fairy as well from there. Owie! All right, back to. Oh hey, click clock wood again, but different. Oh no, spaghettification. Oh wait, was there another? Oh shoot. I did not realize you requested that, Proxima. I'm sorry. Uh, Ambush Attack from Final Fantasy IX has been added to the queue and will be played after this. There will be plenty of time for it, so don't worry. I'm sorry, I didn't see that. Uh-oh, spaghettification -os. <laughs> I remember those commercials. Campbell spaghettification -os. mm mm dead. I hate how you need to play this, ride the platform once to get to the scarecrow and make him appear, and then you need to ride it again to actually, you know, get the prize from the scarecrow. Well, spaghettification is an actual word for having your uh, particles slowly disappear. There's an Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask crossover randomizer? Oh, I would totally play that with you. 100%. If we can, yeah, if we can get your controller working. And not running at a snail space. <laughs> if that was the, is that, is, so is that the case one person plays Ocarina of Time, one person plays Majora's Mask? If so, honestly, I'd, I'd be fine with playing either of them. You need something like this on a day like this? I do. Give me $400. I don't think there was a grotto somewhere I didn't check. I think I got them all. Oh, it opens at 10 p.m. Oh, great. Oh, great! Well, that would be exciting for sure. <laughs> it's not just Sockworks. All of the Humongous Entertainment Junior arcades use that font. And yeah, one of my favorite fonts. All right. Oh my gosh, there it is. <laughs> it's a nice trap. Cool. <laughs> yep, I had to check every spot. Because I always have to check every spot. Especially when I play Majora's Mask Randomizer. I always have to check every spot. <laughs> Oops, I accidentally typed in Abush Attack instead of Ambush Attack. It's okay. YouTube was smart enough to uh, figure it out. Here we go. Huzzah!
Actually, we don't have to slow down time until it starts getting really close. I have not played Crazy Drake before. I appreciate people taking a vested interest in what I play, but as I've said many times before, I don't take requests. You can request stuff to me and there's a chance I'll play it, but... It's uncommon when that happens. Oh wait, no, that's actually what I wanted. Mulgara Battle has been added to the song queue. <laughs> Will I play Majora? Uh, I don't know, Proxima. That game sounds dumb. Lol. <laughs> <laughs> So now we gotta rush through this dungeon ASAP, but it shouldn't take too long, because we already have the small keys. Well, thank, thank you. I think it's a fun stream as well. But I'm also biased, because I'm the one playing it. <laughs> You guys are just watching. I'm the one who's actually doing it. Oh boy, we get to do the block puzzle again. Block puzzle is... it's just tedious. It's not, like, bad. Alright, here comes the Mulgara battle. Oh yeah, here we go. Wind Waker is far from my favorite Zelda game, but it did have some great music. It just had too much sailing. Okay, this is the part where we got to invert this all the time. I did not want you to climb up that, you butt. Stop climbing up it and just grab onto it. Yeah, the sailing was very, very... I, I didn't like the... It's like, oh, the world map is a bunch of small islands. Like, I didn't really like that. There is a randomizer for Fast Near Door, but I think it's only an entrance randomizer, and not like an actual, oh, you get coops, but it's actually a power plus badge. Which, that... Entrance randomizers are fine, they just kind of hurt my head a little bit. But if there's one where it actually does randomize, like, the items and stuff, I would be down to give that a try. I just hope it's not... A case of like, oh, you, you need to use super guards in order to get anywhere, because I am bad at super guards. One of the reasons why I've kind of avoided hardcore Thousand Year Door mods. Oh, it's this guy again! Oh yeah, Linkus! He's, he's a cool guy. I also saw the video on how they managed to conquer Splish Kaboom. That was a really cool video. Dog on it. He had to be up there, didn't he? Blah! 
Why did Rayman, the original, have such good graphics and such great music, but just be unfairly punishingly difficult? <laughs> yeah, possibly. Splish! <laughs> the heat map video is really cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Somebody wants to be handicapped. <laughs> Get the new kid. Beat him down. Alright folks, when I fight Twin Mole, do I use Giant's Mask or do I use Fierce Deity's Mask? I will I will use either one, whichever stream chat wants. Always my get guilty pleasure game. Wait, your brother beat Rayman one? <laughs> wow, that's impressive. All right, folks, Fierce Deity Mask, Giant's Mask. Which one? Or do I use Fierce Deity's Mask to kill one of them? And then the giant's mask to kill the other one. No, I like this idea. Fierce Deity Mask to kill one of them. Kill the red one. It's not too hard to aim. You just gotta know where to stand. Just gotta know where you stand. Moon at me, man. Yes, we get to go to the moon after this. It wouldn't be Majora's Mask if we didn't make an astrological search. There we go. All right. Toho Imperishable Night Voyage 1969 has been added to the song queue, and as a matter of fact, will be played right now. Alright, Toho Imperishable Night Voyage 1969. I always, anytime I see the game named Toho, I always want to call it Tahu. But... That that's just my obsession with Bionicle, don't worry. Alright, here we go. Oh, I I did not like 3DS to uh, twin mold at all. 3DS twin mold sucked.
It was kind of cool how, like, you got the Giant's Mask partway through the fight, but I hated using the Giant's Mask in that, because you didn't get to use a sword. You had to do some weird, like, fighting game 30-hit combo system. I... I'm sorry, I do not remember those commercials. I remember Zoo Pals! <laughs> Yep, yeah, this is Twin Mold on an emulator! <laughs> I'm sorry, how is he not taking damage? I slashed him in the face like five times. There we go. I think people can see that based on my tracker. There we go. It's Twin Mold's remains. And the final boss should be uh, really, really easy because we got Fierce Deity's Mask. That Gawai's really happy. He's like, hey, thanks for dealing with Twin Mold. That was really cool. <laughs> Alright, con the Concubine's Battles from Prince of Persia has been added to the song queue. Because why not? And that'll probably be the last song of the night. <laughs> hey, Skull Kid! I'd like to I'd like to join your posse, but first I'm going to sing a little song. <laughs> Ooh, well, this is kind of fitting music. Show me your real face. Okay, fine. Will you play with me? You only have weak masks. Um, you are wrong. You are very wrong here, Majora bro. Fierce deity mask is weak. You don't have the circus leader's mask. <laughs> The Circus Leader's Mask, now that is a strong mask. Actually, for Majora, you can only kill him using the Blast Mask. It's always Georg's remains that are the annoying ones. So let's just take him out. Bye-bye! <laughs> Pretty much is. Hey, Majora's incarnation is a joke with Fierce Deity Mask. So is Majora's Wrath. <laughs> Especially with Chateau Romani. <laughs> it's almost like the final boss was not balanced for this. <laughs> Wrath. It's so overpowered, it lags the game. He actually got a hit on me, but he's dead. <laughs> there we go! He actually got a hit on me. Good job. Good job, Majora's Wrath.
with your whip arms of flesh. Now, how could you? I just wanted my way. <laughs> Get out. The moon's just like, <laughs> I'm still here! You guys didn't forget about the moon, did you? Alright. Now I want to look at the spoiler. So, let's see. We missed the all-night mask. Okay, the all-night mask was, uh, damp a digging. So, the grave for a day in the graveyard. How about the blast mask? Blast mask was the gr day one grave. Okay, yeah, so that wasn't needed. Circus leader. Circus leader's mask was also in the day one grave. Okay. <laughs> How about the cap? If the captain's hat was also in the graveyard, like, good lord. Captain's hat was on the moon in the Link trial. And how about Don Garrow's mask? Don Garrow's mask was also in Link's trial on the moon. Cool. What I want to know is... There are a couple of checks that I want to... So, everything on the moon... There was an ice trap that looked like Chateau Romani. There was a red rupee. There was Don Garrow's mask, the captain's hat, the great bay small key... <laughs> Piece of heart and the pictograph box as well. <laughs> cool. Um, how about the great fairy fountain for Stone Tower? That was an empty bottle. So that was the remaining. That was the last of the six bottles. How about the great bait? Uh, stray fairies. Seahorses were a piece of heart. That was vanilla. Um. Great Bay Fairy for... <laughs> Great Bay Great Fairy was uh, 50 bucks. Cool. Awesome. Alright, I think that about covers it then. That was a fun seed! Really enjoyed that. YouTube's too slow, yeah. It does have the tendency to be pretty you know slow. The exciting thing about winning? It's when you win. I love that feeling. So do I. So do I. Alright, well, I think that was a great stream to end 2022 out on, so... I got big plans for 2023. I got a lot of stuff I want to stream, and... I already have several Let's Plays planned out for, uh... 2023 as well. I already know what my first two are going to be, and... I actually might be posting a little bit of a, uh, Hint towards that later on in December. Maybe on Christmas. So... Gonna be fun. I I am oh, currently recording it. <laughs> Almost close to the end. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be terrible at the same time. <laughs> well, mainly once we get to the end. But I, I'm I'm looking forward to it. I've wanted to let's play it for a while, so it's gonna be good. Okay. See ya. See ya. Happy mask salesman. That. <laughs> and so he walks off as he lived creepily. <laughs> Yeah, thanks for joining in, everybody. It was great chatting with you all, and I hope I see you guys some more for 2023 Let's Plays and Streams. It's going to be a lot of fun. Going to have... Going to be some great games that are played. I might be playing Shovel Knight pretty early in the new year for streaming as well, because another, okay. another great game that I love playing. Anyhow, I'm going to bid you all a fair... A farewell. So, I will see you guys next year. Hope you guys have a fantastic holiday break. God bless everyone. Take care.